So good afternoon, welcome to eRepair. Uh, so today I'm doing another video on uh, Samsung Galaxy Tab. This one is the Samsung Galaxy Tab A. Um, it's a 10.5 2019 model. Um, so we're going to do a quick uh, how to factory reset video. So you might have already seen my one for the SMT580. Uh, the process is very, very similar. Uh, so we'll just go through a quick process of how to uh, reset the tablet from within the Samsung Android OS and we'll also go through the process of how to do it um, without the tablet being, yeah, well, without being able to get into the tablet. So let me just log into this for you and I will show you how to go around. Sorry, I've just booted this up as you can see, so it's, uh, it's just doing its initial startup. Right, so what we would do, we would go into uh, settings and then to do our reset, we would go general management and reset, and then we would select the factory reset option. And that will go through the process of removing all your accounts and wiping the tablet. And we'll put it back to a, a factory default state. So if we were locked out of this tablet, we didn't know the pin, um, what you would do is you would turn it off, hold the power button down on the side and shut the thing down. If it is set up in a state where it asks you for a pin code to turn it off, you can hold the power and volume down buttons and that will, after about seven or eight seconds, it will go back to um, an off, a powered off state. So to get into recovery, what we're gonna do is we're gonna hold the volume up key, which is this one here on the side, and the power button. Um, we're gonna hold them until we see the Android recovery icon. So uh, we'll do that, no, sorry, Android Recovery logo even. So we just do that. And then as soon as you see that come up, you can let go of both buttons. Again, it'll take two or three seconds. There you are, very quick. You saw the blue screen initially very, very, very quickly there, and then it will disappear again. So at this point, you're gonna be taken to your screen where you're gonna have a list of options. Let me see if I can zoom you in so you can see that a little bit more clearly. So, at the very top here, we've got Reboot System. What we're gonna do is we're gonna use the volume down arrow key, so the volume down key, and that will scroll you down the list. And we're gonna go down until we can get to Wipe Data and Factory Reset. That's the one that we're interested in and nothing else. So we press the volume, the volume down key to get to it. At that point, we're gonna press the power button, and that will then give us a prompt saying, are you sure you wanna wipe all your data? You can't undo it. Again, volume down key, and then we're going to press the power button again to select yes. So zoom back out now. So the bottom of the screen down here, um, you'll see that it says formatting data, formatting cache, data wipe complete. And that's it. Uh, in essence, you have successfully wiped the device. Um, at, the at the top here, it will now be selecting reboot system now again. You'll press the power button to select it and the device will restart. And at that point, it should be wiped and should just go straight back to a setup screen. So I'll, let, I'll leave the video playing just so that you can see what, what process it goes through. This will take a couple of minutes, so I'll speed it up. Um, but yeah, keep watching and you'll see what happens. So hopefully that's taking you through the process. As you can see now, um, we're back at the setup screen and that's in effect it. Um, so your device will have been wiped. Anything that's on it, anything nefarious should have been removed. Uh, and that's it, you just go through the setup process as you normally would and off you go, you can use your tab again. Anyway, I hope that's been useful to you. Um, I'll, I'll continue to do these as the technology emerges and hopefully that we'll um, We'll keep getting an in incoming amount of devices, but I doubt the Samsung white process will change very much. 
Anyway, if you found the video useful, um, drop us a comment, leave us a like, subscribe to the channel, press the bell icon so you get all our notifications, and uh, we'll, we'll try and post as updated content as soon as we can. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.